We'll keep this. I, I already like the yellow. The yellow is worth it. No tail. We don't want tail. Okay. Minor changes all around, but you know, who cares? Who cares? I think you need me to talk to you. You almost blew yourself up. There's no way you don't want someone to talk to you right now. Druids will always follow nature's purpose over any mortal threat. Halsin goes where he is needed, as must we. No doubt she has the power to do so, but as for the permission, Ao would not look kindly on her meddling in mortal affairs. Divine intervention has a tendency to make things worse, not better. As for Elminster, he saved the realms more times than legend can recount. To take on a god is no easy feat, even for him. My orb is the best chance we have. And only I can wield it. Your orb. Oh, you know me, never the optimist. I'm trying to focus on the positives. The truth is, I was living on borrowed time already. Consuming those items would only have kept the orb sated for so long. If anything, I feel more at peace than I have in months. At least now I know my death will have purpose. It won't be a distant bang in the footnotes of history. <laughs> a distant bang, it'll be an up close and personal bang. Um. Ah, oh, yes. Carsus was perhaps the most powerful wizard that ever lived child who would be a god the elves and he tried with a spell of his own devising he endeavored to usurp in one fell swoop the power of the goddess of magic. oh I, I, I actually know this lore she was called then imagine what it must have felt like to be a god to know yourself to be untouchable to be mistaken as Carsus aimed his spell at her she began to unravel and with her the entire weave. Too late did he realize what he had unleashed. It would have been the end of everything had not Mistral sacrificed herself. The goddess of magic is all magic. By dying, the entire weave was lost and the spell that challenged a god failed. It was the end of Mistral, the end of Carsus, and the end of an entire civilization. As the child who would be a god was turned to stone, his empire came crashing down around him. Yep. The floating cities of Necaril were no more. An event that came to be known as Cartus's folly. Uh. For a spell, Mistral was reborn as Mistra. Upon her return, the weave returned with her. Now, so many centuries later, I tried to follow in the footsteps of Cartus. Not to destroy Mistra, but to prove my love for her. Tried to control only a fraction of the magic that was unleashed that fateful day. I merely sought to return one tiny diamond to an imperfect crown. Gale's folly, one might call it. History, repetition. It's the way things go. Gale also has quite a bit of baggage. But you know. You can't be an adventurer without a little bit of baggage. I'll keep it a buck fifty with you. A little bit of baggage is what drives all these adventures. And now we gotta go to Baldur's Gate. The pinnacle of baggage. <laughs> I mean, they have the cold of Tiamat going on in there for God's sake. Alrighty. What do we want to do here? We still have this to do. Oh, wait, no, that's the new thing. I thought we had... 
I feel like there's way more shit to explore here that I just haven't wandered around to explore. We leave the heart of the absolute alive. Thanks to you. You did well to defeat Ketherick. But Ketherick was only the first to fall. There are many more battles ahead. Speak in facts. have already inspired those around you but if we are to succeed we will need others uh. Baldur's Gate may not know it yet but its fate is bound to ours seek on its streets those whose purpose aligns with our own and invite them together we will put nice. Why do I feel like she's going to turn on me in the end? I really do. Alright, let's see here. I didn't mean to do that. We need the moon lantern out. Fucking. Do you have a moon lantern? That's the broken one. What is this? First of all, you. Second of all, I guess I'll take it. We're going to explore before we leave because I have a feeling we could use an extra level up and it's possible we could find one here. Not to mention there's a bunch of shit we haven't looked at. So. The fuck? Gorilla. How the fuck you expect? You're over there hiding. I fucking see you. Is it a demon? We found a dwarven thrower in here. Mason sound like a dwarvish person could be working here. At least. I see no hammer. That's a pickaxe. I am I still am correct. No hammer. Excuse me? 